Hey Nintendo fans and collectors, this is Lithium017 from my channel Nintendo Collecting, bringing you an unboxing video of the special edition Nintendo 3DS XL, which includes the Link Between Worlds. This one looks awesome, it's gold, it's modeled after the game or the concept from the game. I'm very excited to get this. So first let's take a look at this box. It was released today on November 22nd. This is an XL console. The screen is 90% larger than normal. Obviously, this does come with the game, but it does come with the game as a full download so that you don't actually get the physical copy. As a collector, I really hate that. I'd rather it come with the game. Now, I almost feel like I need to buy the game twice. One to collect the actual game, one to actually get this special edition. On the back of the box, it just shows you that this is from a Legendary Kingdom, and there's a whole new adventure to play. So yes, this is very similar to A Link to the Past, but it's the sequel, so it does take place in a very similar world. But now instead of the Dark World, there's Low Rule, and when you're in that world, actually, you can go around to any dungeon you want, in any order you want, and you can actually go rent items rather than finding them in a dungeon and using them throughout that dungeon specifically. Here you are seeing a little model of what the console will look like with the Hyrule and low roll symbols of the Triforce. Looks fantastic. The one side of the box just looks simple like that, but it looks really cool. Mine has two of those circular stickers on it. The one side looks like that. It does say on the side of the box, Zelda edition. Very neat. Very cool. On the other side of the box, it does look similar with, oh, there it is, one sticker on this side. So actually, I'm going to open it up from this side. This obviously does say that it's from Nintendo, and it says it includes the 3DS, the AC adapter, the stylus, the 4 gigabyte, actually, memory card, which is awesome, and then obviously the AR cards that we are always getting. And then the last side is obviously those little warning information. So let's actually open this up. The sticker I have already started to peel away very, very slowly, very carefully, because collectors don't want this ripped, don't want this damaged. So if you have circles on yours, just be very, very careful. Now opening this console should become a lot easier just because they've gone the way of the dodo with actually sealing these boxes for the handheld consoles anyways, and it's just cardboard now. So it's very easy to open it up. It's very easy to actually see what comes in this without doing any damage to anything. And there's all the instructions and the AR cards. Let's actually see what comes in here. So you have the AR cards, as always, tons of those. You do have the full game download, which I will download, so you don't have to worry about that. Put that down. Again, there's the Club Nintendo card, which I will enter right away so that people don't get it onto my console. And then it comes with the quick start guides and obviously the manuals. Everything that you are used to saying, seeing already, so that you don't have to really worry about that. The boring stuff, obviously, this actually does come with a charger, that's good news. Some of them don't come with chargers. What a waste! Then you have to go out and get your own charger. And of course, the thing that we're all waiting for is the console. Now the console looks like you can get it a few ways, but the easiest way to probably get it, put that flap up, slide this down. And I love the way they package these consoles simply in this foam. This is pretty exciting. This is basically Christmas today, let's be serious. With Mario 3D World and this console and A Link Between Worlds coming out on the same day, this is Christmas for Nintendo fans. So here on the console, you can see that looks really, really cool. The Triforce is right there. It looks shiny. You do have the two cameras, and this gold is spectacular. The bottom of the console is black. It does say Nintendo 3DS, and I put my fingerprints all over it already. And there we have the low rule symbol. If you're wondering about the stylus, the stylus is full black. It's not gold, which is kind of unfortunate. Then if we open this up, everything here is gold, and that looks really cool. This just looks like it's screaming of rupees or screaming of money. This looks awesome. The gold really looks spot on. It looks fantastic. So all the buttons are still black, if you were wondering. The circle pad's still gray. Even the slider is still gray as well. But I think there's enough gold. Basically, it looks like a pimped out console. I think it looks so neat. And the really cool part about it is, when you're playing it and other people are looking at your console, they can kind of tell right away that it's the Zelda, based on these two. So when you're walking around playing your console, you will know, and you will let everyone know, that I am a cool Zelda nerd. Thank you for watching my unboxing video of the Zelda 3DS XL console, which I'm really excited about. I'm so excited about playing this game. Basically, happy Christmas to everyone, because this is out, Link Between Worlds is out, and Mario 3D World is out today. If you like the video, feel free to fill that like bucket, follow me on Facebook and on Twitter, and remember, as always, game on.